gentlemen welcome back to the channel for another awesome season 6 edition of wwe supercard i'm your host of course newology and i hope you all are having a fantastic day or night so far so lots is going to be happening here in the video i am going to be finishing up the heroic upgrade for Undertaker from Ring Domination. I also have a Grand Challenge Reward Pack to open up, uh, some Consolation TBG Packs. My girlfriend has enough League Points uh, for me to open up a Giant Platinum League Pack. And uh, yeah, it's going to be a pretty awesome video, so make sure you do stick around and make sure if you do go on to enjoy what you see in this video to smash that like button as hard as you physically could, Dead Man style, by hitting it with a Tombstone Pile Driver. Of course, subscribe to the channel if you're new. It really means so much to me if you guys could do that and don't forget to also turn on notifications for the channel as well so this way you never miss a single supercard video that i post here on the channel ever again i do feature lots of great supercard content such as qr codes giveaways you know uh, pack openings all kinds of supercard stuff so if you don't want to miss out on that stuff subscribe turn on notifications and without further ado guys let's dive into the video okay so i'm gonna start this video off by finishing up the undertaker from ring domination i'm about one maybe two games away from getting this card done so let's buy myself a pick doubler here let's dive into this game and let's hopefully get this card finished up right after this one and uh, let's go for like a Royal Rumble opponent. There we go. I definitely do not want to face WrestleMania 36 plus players because they're pretty hard. But if I get a standard WrestleMania 36 player, I'll be like, okay, whatever. You know, sometimes I'll face them. But I typically try to go for the Royal Rumble players just because they're a little bit easier to beat. So yeah, it's pretty much the story there with that. Let's get this game done and let's hopefully get the card done too. All right, of course he's going to attack me, but you're just going to lose anyways because you're attacking my 36 pro cesaro like how stupid of a move that is all right so that's that and now let's put samoa joe down here and we got the winner winner chicken dinner folks we are officially done with that one hopefully we'll be done with this card too all right so let's see if i could get this thing finished up i probably won't though i have a feeling i'm gonna have to play at least like one more game all right so this is it officially this is the final freaking game so let's dive into it and let's get this card done and, um, yeah, I'm so glad the grind is about to be over. It really is annoying doing six cards for ring domination. That's why, like, I don't always go for the heroic upgrades just because it's just a lot more playing that I don't like doing. But I figured it's worth it. You know, it's the Undertaker. I did it for Edge, too. So I'm like, I might as well just do it for Undertaker as well. And I'm glad I did because it does make the card a lot stronger. So that's a good thing. And, uh, yeah, here we go, guys. We're back to the thing here. Let's get this done now. And let's see if we can get a cool reset here. Probably not, though. All right. Oh, we get an Undertaker. Okay. Um, what else? Okay, pick doubler. Don't need that now, though. And let's see what the last one is. Ah, it's just a Titan manager, Bob Backlund. Wah, wah, wah. All right, so nothing good there, but there we go. It's finished up. And, uh, yeah, let's get this thing applied to my card. Ah, that's so cool. There we go, guys. Very, very awesome. What do you guys think about that? I got the Half Heroic Pro. Let me know how you guys did in this ring domination for yourselves. Did you guys get, you know, the event card? Did you get the Heroic Upgrade? And let me know if you got the Heroic Upgrade from Road to Glory to make the full Heroic Pro. I'd love to hear from you guys, so make sure you do comment down below. But anyways, coming up next now, I do have that Grand Challenge Reward Pack to open up for you guys. So let's dive into it right now. Now, and please, Cat Daddy, give me a little bit of luck with this today. My luck with these packs have been so freaking bad. I cannot say that enough. It's just been terrible with the Grand Challenge reward packs for me lately. And uh, I just need some luck. So let's get some hashtag luck down below in the comment section because I don't know if Cat Daddy's going to help me out here. So if they're not going to help me out, I need some luck from you guys to help me get a WrestleMania 36 card here today from this pack so let's get that hashtag luck down below like i said and let's see if that actually does give me some luck so here we go guys you ready let's dive into it will i get a wrestlemania 36 card let's find out guys in three two one all right no it did not happen wow i mean i get two royal rumble cards 
it's it's not super terrible, but seriously, like I'm over Royal Rumble cards. I don't need them. And honestly, I feel like I'm due for my tier pull again because I've been pulling a couple of Royal Rumble cards from the board. I pulled a Royal Rumble Roman Reigns a little bit ago, and just recently I pulled a Royal Rumble table, some kind of support I pulled. So I keep getting Royal Rumbles for some reason, so I feel like I'm due for my tier pull once again. But let's see what I get here from this pack. The first Royal Rumble is Randy Orton. All right, there's that. And now for the last Royal Rumble, it's Titus O'Neil. All right, guys. So, yeah, that was pretty dang disappointing. Not going to lie. Like I said, I've been having pretty bad luck with these packs. And unfortunately, the hashtag luck did not work. So that, that kind of stinks a little bit. But anyways, now let's get into claiming my consolation pack here from TBG. I cannot believe how much this team destroyed us. Like, we got just completely dominated. So uh, yeah, that's that's not good. They, they got a perfect TBG. So yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. I don't know what to say uh, other than congrats to hashtag the click for just completely dominating, getting that perfect TBG. Um, but anyways, guys, let's dive into this right now. Let's see what I get from this stupid silver pack in three, two, one. All right, so it's a Nightmare in a Vanguard. Woo! Awesome rewards. Not really. All right, so there's my battle points, guys. The Nightmare is Dash Wilder. And now for the Vanguard card, I get myself Andrade. I cannot do the tongue roll. My girlfriend likes to do the tongue roll, but yeah, I, I can't do no tongue roll at all. I'm terrible at it. But uh, anyways, guys, coming up next, I want to talk about the freaking quest. Could you believe I still cannot get this thing done? I need literally one more Leo Rush card. That is it. For some reason, I cannot pull this final Leo Rush card that I need to get this thing finished up. And it's really annoying. Like, oh, like look at how close I am. I'm right there. I'm about to cross the, uh, cross the finish line and get this thing done. But that stupid Leo Rush egg card is holding me back. And I just can't seem to pull it. I was even spending my money in the bank contracts trying to pull uh, one final Leo Rush egg card. And uh, yeah, I spent all my contracts. Could not pull it to save my life. But hopefully soon I can pull this thing so I can freaking feature it in a video. And let me know how you're doing with this quest for yourselves. Are you guys kind of stuck in the same situation as me where you can't get like one more Leo Rush egg or whatever other egg. Maybe like Cameron Grimes or something you're stuck on. Let me know, or did you get the quest completed? And if you did get the quest completed, what did you get from it? Did you get, like, a Royal Rumble? Did you get a WrestleMania 36? Maybe you got something else because it is based on your top 8 rarity. So if you're a lower tier, maybe you got something else, like a Primal or something like that. And let me know if you ended up getting, uh, you know, the Spring British Bulldog card or Triple H. I still really want to get this card. I'm hoping once I get this quest finished up, I could get the Triple H card because it's just freaking beautiful. That image is just phenomenal and I really want to get it. But anyways, now let's head on to my girlfriend's account. She does have that uh, consolation pack or silver pack for me to claim from TBG. And also, she has enough league points, as I mentioned earlier, for me to open up a giant platinum league pack. So yeah, let's head on there right now and let's see what she ends up getting from that stuff. All right, so now that I'm on here, we're going to start this off here with her silver pack since this is probably the least important thing. So yeah, let's dive into this right now and let's see what she ends up getting from this. Too bad we couldn't get a couple more hundred points to get, you know, at least over 10,000 because if we would have gotten over 10,000 points, we would have gotten a gold pack, which is a lot better than a silver pack, but unfortunately we could not get there. Um, but anyways, here we go with this pack right now. Let's see what she gets from this, folks, in three, two, one. One. All right, so, ah, she gets Luke Gallows. I feel like I've been pulling this card a lot lately. I still keep pulling bald men, guys. You know how it is. All right, so uh, there's her battle points. And now for the Nightmare card, she gets Roderick Strong, okay? So, yeah, that's the story there with that. And now, guys, let's move into this Giant Platinum League pack here to wrap the video up. Let's see if she'll get a WrestleMania 36 card here today from this. That would be quite awesome. So, yeah, what are we waiting for? Let's dive into this right now and let's see what she gets. All right, so, man, it's not looking like she's getting a 36 card here. Unless that last one is a 36 card. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's not looking like it, though. All right, so she gets a Vanguard Alexa Bliss. Nope. It was a Vanguard card, so no WrestleMania 36 card, not even a Royal Rumble card from this. Wow, this was extremely disappointing, folks. So, uh, yeah, Vanguard City people, and yeah, what do you guys think? Oh, it's a, it's a female pack. Wow, this really was a freaking female pack, guys. She got all females there. 
what the freaking heck? Too bad vanguards aren't that beneficial anymore. Um, but anyways, guys, that's pretty much going to do it here for the video. I do want to thank you guys so much for stopping by, spending your time with me, and watching the video. Remember, if you went on to enjoy this video, to smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, of course, if you're new, and don't forget to also turn on notifications for the channel as well, so this way you never miss a single Supercard video from me here on the channel ever again. But anyways, have an awesome rest of your day or night. Catch y'all later. Take care. And of course, peace out.